What's up guys, it's Cody here. And today in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to jailbreak iOS 12 up to iOS 12.1.2. Now this is only going to work up to A11 devices. So anybody that has an iPhone XS Max or an iPhone XS, those are A12 devices and they're not going to work with this jailbreak just yet. The support for A12 devices is coming and that's coming directly from the mouth of Pwn to Own who is the developer of this jailbreak. So if you guys want to stay up to date of when A12 devices are compatible with this jailbreak, then make sure you follow me on Twitter and I'll be sure to let you guys know. But in this video, I'm gonna be using a iPhone 10, which is an A11 device, and it's going to be on iOS 12.0. And I'll show you that right here. If I go into general and about, we have iOS 12.0. Now, another thing to keep in mind is if you are not on one of these compatible firmwares, you can downgrade to iOS 12.1.1 beta three that is still being signed right now. I recommend you guys doing that right now because the signing window can close at any time. And it wouldn't surprise me if Apple closed it even sooner just because there is a jailbreak out for it. So if you're not downgraded and you wanna jailbreak your device, downgrade right now and then come back to this video to figure out how to jailbreak. Now, once you're on a compatible firmware, the very first thing that you need to do is delete any over the air updates. This is very, very important. So if you have friends that are not following any video tutorial, be sure to let them know because it's very important. This can throw your device into a boot loop if you don't delete this over the air update. So the way to check for this is just go into settings and then go to general, like where I am right now, tap on iPhone storage. And then if you see an over the air update in here, which this usually just takes forever to load. So we'll scroll down here. Let's see if they've downloaded. It'll be a settings icon. It doesn't look like it's here because it should be a whole lot bigger than all of these. So I don't have an over the air update on this device, but it'll show up pretty close to the top because you can see these are in descending order uh, from largest to smallest. So it should be up here pretty close to the top. It'll have a settings icon. It'll say the firmware right up there at the top. And then you just tap on it and then you can tap delete right there. So delete your over the air updates before you go through the jailbreaking process. That is very, very important. Now let's go ahead and jump into the actual process of this. This is very familiar if you guys have jailbroken before. If you haven't, I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. Now, all you wanna do is just go to a few different websites. The first one being the actual jailbreak website, or this is actually a GitHub uh, repository. And you're just gonna scroll all the way down here to the very bottom. Now, there are two IPAs right here. The one you wanna download is the B29.IPA. That's the newest one. You can see right here that the B29 is released for public testing. So we're just gonna go ahead and download that, which I already have, and then I put it on my desktop right here. And then the next thing that you wanna do is download Cydia Impactor if you don't have it. You can just tap on or click on Mac OS or Windows, whichever operating system you're running. If you're using Linux, then you can use you know one of these over here as well. Now, this part you guys have probably done before. If you haven't, it's really straightforward. All you wanna do is open up your Cydia Impactor, make sure your device is recognized. So obviously you have to have your device plugged in to your computer in order for this to work. And then it'll show your phone right here and then grab the IPA that you downloaded and drag it over it. So right here, you'll just enter in your iTunes account, hit enter, and then type in your Apple password. Now, if you get this error, that means that you have two auth set up on your device, which means you're gonna have to generate an app specific password. So this is really simple to do too. So just go ahead and click okay right there and then open up your browser again. And then you're gonna to wanna to go to appleid.apple.com. Of course, for all these websites, I'll have them all uh, linked in the description. So you guys can just click on it and then start uh, the process from there. So just sign in right here. And then once you're logged in, you're gonna to wanna to click on generate password right here. So just click on that. And then you can label this, you know, whatever you want to. I'm gonna label it JB for Justin Bieber, obviously. Click create, and then it'll give you an app specific password. This is the password that you're going to use for jailbreaking your device. So you can just click done at this point and then we'll do the exact same process once again. So we'll go ahead and drag the IPA over here, drop it, put in your iTunes email, click okay. And then we're just going to paste in that password that we just generated. Click okay and then it should go ahead and go through the process of installing Uncover the app onto your device. So we'll go ahead and let it do its thing and then we should be back here in just a second. All right, so it's pretty quick and you can see the uncover is right here. So at this point, all we wanna do 
is tap on uncover and you'll see that we have an untrusted developer. So what we have to do is go back into the settings and we're gonna go into general, scroll all the way down here and tap on profiles and device management. Right down here, you'll see a developer app. So you'll tap right there and then tap on your iTunes email right there. And then it should go ahead and trust that developer and then verify the app, which you can see right there. At this point, you can go ahead and open up Uncover again and then just tap Jailbreak. So it's gonna go through its entire exploiting process and then it'll reboot the device and then hopefully we'll have Cydia installed on our device. So I'll speed up through this process just a little bit and then I'll meet you on the other side. All right, so we are back. Let's go ahead and unlock our device. Let's see if we have Cydia on here. Looks like we have Uncover, but I do not see Cydia. So if it didn't work, reboot your device and try it again. All right, so this is good. We actually have a uh, pinwheel here, which I haven't seen yet, which is pretty indicative that it worked. So let's go ahead and unlock our device here. And let's hope that Cydia is installed, which it is right there. Thank the Lord. Let's open this thing up. Hopefully it'll work. Awesome. It doesn't look like it's going to crash here. All right. So this is my device that I actually had two devices that I tried to jailbreak and I just don't have any faith in them whatsoever that they're going to be able to be jailbroken. One of them was failing on step two and just rebooting itself. And the other one was failing at step 27 consistently with the same exact error that it couldn't extract the bootstrap. So on this device, it only took three tries uh, to jailbreak my phone. So I'm hoping it's only going to take three or four tries for you guys as well. Unfortunately, on my other two devices, it's just not working. I'll just have to wait until maybe there's some bug fixes or an update comes out for Uncover. Now, I know a lot of you guys have probably been wondering where I've been. Of course, I'm not going to get into that into this video, but I will put out a video at some point in the near future explaining kind of where I've been. I've missed you guys, and from some of your tweets and YouTube comments, you guys have missed me. So. Hopefully we can get back into the swing of things and I can start getting some content out for you guys on a regular basis. All right, that's all I got for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys have any questions about the jailbreak or you're having issues, make sure you put them in the comments, in the comments below and help each other out if you're having any issues or if you can offer support. If you guys wanna see you know, top tweak videos or perfect jailbroken setup videos, make sure you hit the like button on this video and I'll be sure to put some of those out for you guys for the newest uncovered jailbreak for iOS 12. All right guys, I'll see you in the next one.